Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to change CO2 tank for the fountain machine. Now, customer comes in and complains that, hey, the drinks are flat, what do you do? Well, you take this, you go in the back, wherever the cylinder is, the first thing you want to do is you want to look at the gauge. When, when it's on green, it will show you that it's full. When it's on red, well, it's time to change the, you know, the CO2 tank. Also, you'll be able to lift it up like this is heavy. I can't, well, I can lift it up, but it's pretty heavy. When the tank is empty, you'll know that it's empty. Safety come first. Anytime you change it, you'll see the button will say open and close. Make sure you turn off your, uh, you cut it off before you, before you do anything with it. Okay. she's turning it off all right so we got it off and what you do is you always have this little special wrench that comes with it you're gonna unscrew that now before you do that just make sure you have a new tank right there in the back and the new tank will have uh, a close like a little red well it's off. It's not coming out of it. you probably heard that and see when she's unscrewing that the gauge went down to all the way to the red because she was unscrewing that. All right, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your empty tank, bring out a new tank. The new tank will have like a little closed valve on it and it's gonna be heavy, then you know that that's a good tank. You basically take the valve out, then you basically make sure it's on closed position, otherwise it's gonna scare the heck out of you. All right, you're gonna screw it in there. And when you see that it's enough, then you're gonna use that wrench to tighten it up. It's very important you tighten it up good and tight. I mean, you don't wanna go super crazy, but you wanna make sure that you do good and tight. All right, and watch and see, I'm gonna turn on the pressure. There you go, I just turned it on, and you see the pressure just went up. And you're gonna turn it, you're gonna open it up all the way till it stops. And see pressure went up all the way that's it and uh, anytime you change co2 tank you must 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 go to the drink machine choose any flavor doesn't matter and run it for about a minute till the motor till the pump kicks in it's very important for the pump and you're gonna have to listen to it closely so the pump can kick in and when pump pump kicks in run it for another five ten seconds then it's gonna come out just fine if you have any more questions, ask somebody at the store or ask your store manager.